Hi, my name is Jonathan. Welcome to Nuxtux Creative Studio. In this lesson, we'll be taking a look at the color grading process for footage that we've color corrected ourselves. Like this one over here, I've already done the color correction. And then we have the color grade. So the LM Creative CG for color grade. Add that. It will add these extra effects over here and we can easily color grade our footage. Now, depending on your workflow or the footage that we're working with, the sharpen and the denoiser don't have to be placed above here. You can actually place them much lower in the stack, all the way at the end even, and we can start. We have video equalization, which is a combination of contrast, brightness, saturation, and gamma, all within one effect. We can use this one to adjust, you know, the contrast, a bit of the brightness, the saturation, and all of these values before we start uh, doing further modifications. And the next one is to add a bit of saturation. So increase the saturation even more. With the lift gain gamma, I added a lot of blue into the midtones, a little bit of red-ish to the shadows, and a bit of yellows to the highlights. And then I played with the values as well. So lifts went darker. So I lowered the shadows, increased the midtones, and decreased the highlights ever so slightly. Next, I added a tint. The tint allows us to add a colors to the shadows and colors to the highlights. And then we can control the tint amount here with this slider. So how much do we want to inject those values? Okay. You can use the color picker to pick your colors or simply left click on the color and input the values here. And then we have curves and I didn't use the curves for this one. Didn't feel like curves were needed right here, but then with the Bezier curve, I did, however, add a bit more contrast. Okay. Could have done it with curves, but I chose to do it with Bezier. The difference between those two are the handles. Bezier curves has handles that you can move around, whereas curves does not, and you can only add three additional points. Okay. Then we have the vignette, so to give it an overall, uh, something to encapsulate it. And finally, we have the sharpen. Well, we can add the vignette all the way after, actually. We have the sharpen, so to make the image a lot sharper, and then the denoiser, to remove any noise that might uh, have been caused by us or have already been in the footage. You can also add your own noise, so grain noise, for example, to the footage. So for some added cinematic look, if you will. All right, and that is essentially it for the color grading, but this is just the basics of it. Uh, later, we'll do a much deeper dive into color grading. All right, and that is it. So if you have any questions, doubts, suggestions, feel free to leave them in the comment section down below and I'll get back to you. This is Nuxtux Creative Studio. My name is Jonathan. I'll see you next time.